The Adjust Page Brightness extension allows you to control your browser's global screen brightness. This means, depending on the time of day, nighttime or daytime, and user-defined settings, you can set a web page to appear lighter or darker. This helps if the website doesn't support dark mode, it also helps reduce eye strain whilst reading documents online, and it helps with things like the white light at a later time of the evening or early in the morning. This extension has lots of features packed inside it, so we're going to go through and have a look at some of the options available. So to begin, we add this to Chrome. After adding to Chrome, we can then pin it to the toolbar. Simply select the jigsaw piece and then select the pin. You can also enable this in incognito mode on your browser by selecting the jigsaw piece again, selecting the three dots and clicking manage extension. Then when you come down the page, you'll see here the option to allow an incognito and we simply turn that on. Now the extension is available inside our toolbar. So let's go to a website such as Wikipedia to demonstrate how it works. So already you can probably see it's working because the screen itself is slightly darker. So to begin, we can left click and we can set some information here. So we can set two times, a daytime light and an evening light. So on the daytime it's currently set and we can increase this. So you can actually go above 100%. So you can go double the brightness of the current screen. And you can bring this down. 100% means it's unaffected and that anything less than this then affects and darkens the screen. So for example, during the day, we may wish to set a blanket rule of 80% and then in the evening, we're gonna reduce this down to 50%. We can then define our day starting at 8 a.m. Uh, we can use the drop down options as well or we can define our evening time so let's change the evening time to 1 p.m now it's currently before 1 p.m so you can see this kicks in if we go ahead and change this to 5 p.m it goes back to the daytime we then have the ability to set this as a blanket rule across all websites or we can set this for this specific host name so this just sets it on wikipedia for example, if we then go to Google, it's unaffected. If we go to Google directly. So we can come here. We can disable it on Google as well. Make it all websites, disable it everywhere. Enable here, enable everywhere. For example, disable here, yet it's still enabled here. So as I say, it can be across multiple different websites. It can be a blanket rule or it can be host specific. If we go ahead, we can also see that there's keyboard shortcuts available. So control and E, control and D, and then others available. So for example, if we press control and E, or control and D, it then has that impact. We can also go to options by right clicking on the extension and we can see the information here. So for example, if we go ahead and change this to so that's google.com Save the option. And you can see with a common depleted list, this now activates. And if we go ahead and remove this, it then comes back. This extension is incredibly helpful for increasing or decreasing the brightness level of a website.
This helps, as I say, when a website doesn't have a dark mode available, and it also helps when viewing white screens at a different time of day, whether during the daytime, during a sunny day, early morning, or late at night.